the lines having to sit and wait for over an hour can be very hectic when it should be a lot easier now these days. I mean, it's just, it's just too much. Joyce Johnson's frustration just trying to renew her driver's license are being echoed by people all over the state. I mean, waiting in line and having to sit for 30 to 45 minutes just to renew your license, there has to be a better solution. And as a possible solution, the Texas Department of Public Safety has come up with a plan to close 87 inefficient driver's license offices. But many of these offices are the only ones in a county. According to DPS, they won't take action without the approval of state leadership. If they close offices, they would have to have some place for people to renew their license, I would think. You can renew your license online, but driver Grace Linebarger is skeptical. So if the websites work really well, then I don't think it's an issue to like close down the offices, but I think that's what they need to focus on first before they actually close any offices. It's an alternative Johnson says could cost your identity. Once you go over there online, you're jeopardizing uh, information that can be, you know, used in conflict for, for other reasons. Now these changes could be decided on by next week, and if accepted, they would move forward to next year's legislation for approval. In Austin, Juan Rodriguez, KB News. And if this plan does go through, 78 counties in all in Texas will not have a DMV license. That's obviously a concern to the people who live in those counties because you can't vote without an official photo ID, and you get that ID at the DMV. Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick saying he does not support this idea.